Philosophical World 3, Unit 7, My Favourite Sport, page 96, exercises 7, 8 and 9. So this lesson is a phonics lesson. We're going to be focusing on two phonetic sounds, that long E and a short E, okay? So here we have the E in team, E, E, team, okay? Again, model this sound in front of your students. Get them to look at your mouth as you make the sound. E, E, team, team, E, E, team. The second sound is a shorter E, E. So the E in hockey, E, E, hockey, E, E, hockey. Okay, it's a shorter sound, okay. Once you feel the students are confident with those two sounds, you can then move on to listen and repeat. So, team, hockey. I'm playing hockey with my team. Okay. When you feel that they're confident on those words, you can then move on to exercise eight. Listen and chant. So this is a fun way in which the students can practice those phonetic sounds they can practice the words using those sounds and some sentences using those words. So let's have a look at our chant. Team, 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 wear this t-shirt. Come play hockey with my team. Team, 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 wear that t-shirt. Come play hockey with his team. Okay, two very similar verses there because each verse uses both of those sounds, okay? If the students are struggling with any of those words that you can hear, please correct them with the right E sound, okay? Once you feel that the students are confident with that chant, you can move on to exercise nine, say it. So this is where they can look at a picture and they can say three sentences describing this picture using the words that have those two phonetic sounds. So sentence number one, I'm wearing my uniform and playing hockey with my team. Sentence two, my team is running and hitting the ball. Sentence three, my hockey team and I can watch our match on TV. Okay, so plenty of words there with those two phonetic sounds. Have the students practice these sentences together after drilling. And if you hear anything wrong, please correct their speech, focusing on the phonetic sounds in those words. That is the end of the lesson.